For years, one of the most dangerous work areas has been the loading dock. With fast-moving forklifts, big trucks, heavy loads, and tight time schedules. So there are plenty of chances for accidents. Studies show that one of the most dangerous spots is the area where the trailer meets the dock. If the trailer is not solidly secured to the dock and separation occurs for any reason, the forklift driver can fall into the gap, suffering serious injury or death. This accident was caused by an unscheduled departure of the trailer from the dock. Unscheduled departures are one of several major causes of accidents at the dock. Others include trailer creep or trailer walk, trailer tip over resulting from landing gear collapse, and trailer upending. Let's take a closer look at these. Trailer creep is a primary cause of serious injuries and damage. This occurs when the constant impact of the forklift against the bed causes the trailer to inch forward. On spotted trailers with air ride suspensions, this movement can be even more pronounced and is called trailer walk or dock walk. Either way, trailer movement creates a deadly gap and wheel chocks are not effective in preventing this dangerous separation. Another type of accident can happen when a trailer is supported only by its landing gear. Heavy loads and the impact of the forklift against the truck bed can cause the gear to collapse, tipping over the trailer, possibly with the forklift driver on board. These accidents can easily happen when landing gear are old, weak, or needing repair. Finally, moving a heavy load into the nose of a spotted pup trailer can cause the rear of the trailer to upend resulting in serious injury and extensive material damage. Every year, accidents like these occur at docks across the country, and they cost companies millions of dollars. But in fact, it is possible to help prevent these accidents with the dock lock vehicle restraint from Right Height. Right Height Corporation, the industry leader in loading dock safety, was the first company to seriously address the problem of trailer separation from the dock. In its quest to develop the best possible solution, Right Height tested many different restraint designs, put them through the toughest trials, carefully evaluated results, and combined the strongest features of each design. Then, in April of 1980, Right Height introduced the dock lock vehicle restraint with its exclusive rotating hook. While Right Height has refined the product over the years, the basic design remains the same. It was the original vehicle restraint, and today the dock lock restraint is still the toughest, most dependable, and safest system on the market. Here's how it works. As the truck backs toward the dock, the ICC bar contacts the slanted housing and positions it to the proper height. The dock worker then simply activates the hook from this push button control inside the dock. The dock lock hook rotates up to capture the ICC bar. Inside the dock, easy to understand lights change from red to green, helping dock workers and truckers know when the truck is secure and when it is safe for forklifts to proceed. Outside the dock, the truck driver sees a red light and warning signs indicating he should not attempt to move the trailer. When the work is finished, the worker simply pushes a button to lower the hook, causing both inside and outside lights to change, and communicating that the trailer is no longer hooked. Many other companies have tried to design restraints as effective as this one, but no other restraint compares to the original. Only the patented dock lock system gives you all these advantages. Since the dock lock restraint is mounted well above ground level, it's out of the way of dirt, debris, ice, snow, and standing water. This means more reliable operation, lower maintenance, and longer product life. The dock lock system is designed for impact, unlike other restraints. It's meant to be hit over and over. Plus, the slanted design lets the housing move easily to the proper position. This rugged construction means your dock lock restraint will keep on working year after year. And because of its unique rotating hook, only the dock lock restraint 
helps prevent so many types of trailer separation accidents. That's because the hook can rotate up and over the ICC bar, limiting both horizontal and vertical movement of the trailer. By controlling horizontal movement, the dock lock restraint helps prevent accidents caused by unscheduled departures and trailer creep or trailer walk. And since the hook can wrap over the ICC bar, it also helps prevent mishaps caused by landing gear collapse, trailer tip over, and trailer upending. No other restraint offers you this feature. The dock lock rotating hook also provides greater vertical reach for below dock and loading. This means the trailer can stay hooked even if the leveler lip depresses the dock lock housing. This has become especially important as more and more trailer beds are now lower due to air ride suspensions, high cube trailers, and low profile tires. And only dock lock restraints are backed by Wright Height's standard written money back guarantee, plus the strongest network of representatives in the industry. With all these advantages, you can see why over 90,000 dock lock units are now installed and operating at Fortune 200 companies around the world. And how, together with the wheel lock non-ICC dependent restraint, your facility can be equipped to safely restrain virtually any trailer that appears at your dock. So make the smart safety investment for your company. Prevent costly accidents and protect your personnel with dock lock restraints from right height.